Today we're gonna to be doing the mobile photography challenge. And the rules are that we can only take one item from our home. Today I chose a stocking cap. I chose a toy Kylo Ren. I chose nothing. And so, rules are we can take three pictures. Then we have to take one out of the three pictures and use that as our prize picture. After that, our dad will judge the three photos and we'll see who wins the dark job. Let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna take a photo of them here, and I have some Kiki over here to help me. I got one of uh, Alfred's sunglasses. So, Alfred, if you're watching this, thank you, so I don't have to use these. Um, I also got the stocking cap that we took from home, and we're gonna take a photo just right about here. I think that might look good. So, we have three. Uh, different photos we can choose from. I feel like this is a sustainable one that we can at least take one for. So we'll take, like I said, we'll take one over here and that should be good. And if it isn't, we'll take a, two others in different manners. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know what I want to do. I don't want to find... Yeah, we'll do it like that. Because that looks pretty good. So I got one, and this looks actually pretty good. So I'm gonna try to take a second one, but this one I'm of like, can you, can you like do something like that? Yeah, like, well, just kind of put this arm under it too. Just kind of press it like that, and then that will be the second. Okay, that's pretty good. That, that's actually really good. So now we're gonna go over someplace else, maybe do something in another location. There's a giant weight over there, so we can <laughs> make you look super strong. Okay. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take those photos but I'm seriously thinking about maybe getting a full body shot. That way we can mask you out and then put you in a, like a city vibe. City style thing. <laughs> okay. Now we're gonna go inside. We're gonna hopefully find another location and take a photo. So we'll be right back with you. So we changed our mind about taking the photo inside only because lighting there wouldn't be very good. And it would be better if it's the light coming from over here and the our subject. So what we're gonna try to do is Man, this is gonna take 10 years to mask out, but um, just over here, that way, if you can come out just a little bit more like this, that way it's easier to tell for the computer, I think, maybe. I I make music. I don't use Photoshop. I have no idea how this is gonna work out, so, but so, we're gonna try it. Okay, so turn your head, go that way. All right, so now we're gonna head over to Sully. Okay, Burkhart and Santigi were, there was a tree, and we're gonna go take the picture by the tree. I was gonna have Amy, but he's jacking right now, so I'm just gonna take a picture of the tree. I don't know if I want it up or from the side or something. Uh, uh, we're just gonna see. The stick was in the shop, we need to get it out. We got the stick out of the shop now, so now. We're gonna take the picture. That's a nice photo. I think our next photo is gonna be a product photo. I think we're gonna take a photo of that camera lens and this camera. Bye bye sweet camera. Now it's Finn's turn to take some photos. So for my photos, I found this little Kylo Ren toy. And I wanted to take a photo of it and then add some glow to his lightsaber in Photoshop. So I think I have a really good idea, but we're gonna go down the hill and go to the bushes, pretty much. So we're down here and I was going to put it here, but the problem is there's a wall over there. And I don't really want the wall in the background, so I'm just gonna have, I'm just gonna have to either crop it down the side or just make something facing towards that way. But let's see. So at the bottom of this guy, there's this black, and I don't like that at all, so I'm gonna need to cover this bottom thing with dirt. So I've covered him with the dirt and it looks much better. It looks like he's actually standing on the ground. But now I need something in the foreground. I have something in the background. Now I need something just like a stick facing there. So I already got one photo and that does look pretty good. I think I'm gonna take one more of that and then I might take a portrait of something because I think that photo is gonna be the best one. I think instead of using this little guy anymore, I am just gonna take a photo of other things like this tree. I don't really know the framing yet. Got two 
two photos now. I took two. You take three pictures. Well, I got two good photos, I guess. That was a mistake. Um, I think we're gonna go home and edit all these photos now. So we'll see you back at the studio when they're done editing and whenever I'm done screaming. So that ding dong accidentally took two photos of a, of a tree. So we're gonna see who wins. Me. So this is my photo uh, raw. I really liked it before I did any of the color grade that I did. And I think that just goes to show that you can take really great photos with just your camera on your phone without doing any uh, editing to it. And then I decided to take it into my computer uh, even then to just see what it would what I could do with it. And I turned it black and white. And I really, really liked that. But I decided to get the uh, his sunglasses, keep them red. I thought that might be kind of cool. Then I wanted to get everything red in the photo. And there's a little bit of red on his shirt. And I wanted to get that uh, colored too. But uh, overall, I think it was a really cool photo. Tell us what you guys think. So this is my raw photo. I, I didn't do much, but crop the photo, adjust sliders, fix colors, and there it is. So this is my raw photo. This is the best photo I could take out of all of them. And this is the edited photo. What I did is I added some glow to the lightsaber, but it just didn't look so good. So then I took a stock footage of a lightsaber with its glowing, mass it out, added it to screen, and then add some lighting effects on him, and then edit it in Lightroom. All right, guys, that was the end of today's mobile photography challenge. You tell us who you think won in the comments, but who uh, our dad thought won was Finn, because he had the most creative editing for the photo. I had the best. Framing of a photo. And Sully came last with the best quality photo, just the best, um, like, 4k image the end of today's challenge i won i have one win scoreboard there and so we will be back with more challenges and more videos with uh -huh. you soon